if y sine 2y is equal to x cosine 2x, then what is dy over dx at the point pi over 4 comma pi over 2? Well, we need to take the derivative with respect to x here. And to do that, we have to use a product rule. So take the derivative of y with respect to x to get dy over dx times sine of 2y plus take the derivative of sine of 2y and get 2 cosine 2y dy over dx times y plus or equals. Now we're going to look at the derivative of the right side. The derivative of x is 1 times cosine 2x. Now take the derivative of cosine 2x and get negative 2 sine 2x and then multiply it by x. At this point, I could just plug in. I don't need to solve for dy over dx just yet. So if I plug in x and y, I'm going to have coefficients of dy over dx, and so then I can easily factor. So we have dy over dx, sine of 2y. y is pi over 2, so that's going to be sine of pi. And then 2y again is pi dy dx times y, which is pi over 2. If x is pi over 4, 2 times pi over 4 is pi over 2. They have negative 2 and then x, x is pi over 4, times sine of 2x, which will be pi over 2. Now some things cancel, so the sine of pi is 0, so this goes away. And cosine of pi over 2 is 0. So this is what we have so far. Cosine of pi is negative 1, and sine of pi over 2 is 1. So we have 2 times negative 1, yeah, 2 times negative 1 is negative 2, times dy over dx, times pi over 2, is equal to negative 2 pi over 4, which is pi over 2, and then times 1. I can cancel out the pi over 2s next, and I can also cancel out the negatives. So I have 2 times dy over dx is equal to 1. So dy over dx is 1 half. And that is my answer.